totally involved but unentangled this is the quality of the divine if you maintain this quality ultimate liberation will be a natural process without involvement there is no life the very process of life is involvement uninvolved you cannot experience life the profoundness of involvement determines the profoundness of one's experience but if one cannot make the distinction between involvement and entanglement then entanglement is a process of suffocating yourself entanglement can suffocate you in such a way that death will seem better than life when you're deeply entangled so it's important to understand the distinction involvement can only happen consciously involvement can be brought about without entanglement only if your involvement is non discriminatory that is you're involved with everything if you're walking on the street the very contact with mother earth the air that you breathe the people that are there the trees everything everything that you are in touch with right now at least in sensory terms the five senses what you see what you hear what you smell what you taste and what you touch if you are absolutely absolutely involved you will see there is no such thing as entanglement but if your involvement is selective that is you discriminate as to what to involve with what not to involve with please understand involvement does not necessarily mean compulsive action when your involvement is absolute and with everything action you will have to choose judiciously what you can do what you cannot do because action needs a prescription of energy time space situational context many things so action cannot be performed in an unbridled manner but involvement can be unbridled if your involvement is absolutely unbridled nothing held back then you will see there is no such thing as entanglement if you hold this quality with yourself if you make this the basic quality of your life absolute involvement but no entanglement then liberation is not something that you have to aspire for it comes to you liberation is not what you have to seek liberation shall seek you